Hey, how's it going? Today I'm going to go over how to draw the Styracosaurus. Um, it is pretty much very similar to the Triceratops, except some horns are a little bit different. And we'll talk about that. It's going to be really cute for beginners and step by step, okay? So let's get started. First thing I'm going to start with that horn. Also, don't forget to pause and rewind as you need to. The more you do that, the better in the end because you'll get into your long-term memory. Curve around here. Out, down, to the front. <clears throat> now like a little bit of a beak shape here, okay? I'm gonna pull back. a little smiley. And pull up. Bump over here. <laughs> Bump over here. This is the brows. And we're going to go over here and draw the eye. And that is going to be just kind of a very similar to that bump. It's gonna be like hee hee. It's gonna hee hee. That kind of squinted eye. Pull a line here for the bottom of the face. <laughs> and then another one for the jaw. So there's no horns, like no big horns right here because of. Uh, it's not Triceratops, this is a Styracosaurus. Uh, it's in the same family though, okay? Very similar to like the way a Jaguar is related to like a tiger. Um, this is similar, okay? Styracosaurus is related to Triceratops. So, but no front horns. Go back here. a curved shape for that crown. Pull another shape right here for that crown in. <clears throat> that crown shape, okay? Pulling down for the front leg. Curve. Up. here for the bottom of the body. <laughs> now we're gonna make its legs really another uh, kind of pillar of a leg. Really close though, to make it cute and short. <laughs> Far side leg, around here. And now the, he does have spikes though, or she, at the top of the crown. Gonna draw those in there. Just don't worry about the number of spikes, but uh, they're all just kind of extended triangles. It could be different sizes. <laughs> Pulling up here, curved. Pulling it here, curve that way. Just to kind of show that bony shape in the middle of the head. So now let's go to the top over here and we're gonna draw his back going down. Got a big thick body going down. And then it's gonna end at a nub of a tail over here. And then this is gonna come over here, see? Just to kind of make it short and cute kind of thing. So just drop something. Let's draw a line at the bottom here for the counter shading. Um, not really gonna have that over here. And now let's draw a couple of upside down U shapes here.
for the nails. I forgot how many nails it has. I think it might have three, but whatever. It doesn't matter. I usually put three or four. All right. And then lastly, I'm going to draw maybe some scattered dots here. Maybe some spikes on his back. Like really small nubs on his back. <laughs> draw them everywhere. Kind of like chocolate chip cookies, you know? Try to make him as random as you can. I'm going to go to the front of the horn here. I'm going to pull a line here. Show some dimension on that horn. If you got to this point, you pretty much... I'm going to throw a line here. You are pretty much done, you know? Congratulations. Uh, good job. If you want to show me your drawing, um, post it on Instagram and tag easy pictures to draw. Okay. Tag easy pictures to draw. If you want to, you know, show me your drawing and I will comment on it and on Instagram and I will also uh, feature it. I'll put it like on the stories of Instagram as well. Just kind of going over here, thickening out the lines. Okay, and then this one's a, a little... Sometimes my markers kind of half die. I'm not really sure what's going on. They kinda, they're kind of a little light. Um, if what I do here is worth your time, please do me a huge favor and subscribe. I post three lessons every single weekday. Uh, and that's just going to keep going. I keep doing, doing that till the end of the year. And I'm slowly kind of upgrading um, how I edit the videos. Um, thank you so much. You've been amazing, okay? Let me know what you think. Uh, maybe give some thoughts for the channel, and I'll let you know if I use them. And also, if you have anything you want me to draw, please write it in the, in the, in the comments, and I'll see what I can do. I'm going to throw a couple of small lines in some of these horns. Not big like the other one, but just some small ones to show some indication. Sharing is caring. Share the video if you enjoyed this. Uh, somebody else might enjoy it as well. Thank you so much. I will talk to you next time and I will see you very, very soon. And it has been easy pictures to draw. Don't forget to say hi to me in the comments if you got to this point. And I'll know that you got to this point if you say hi. I will reply to every single comment. See you later.